First of all, what a beautiful day to be out here. Kids are enjoying the experience of having something like energy be fun and relatable. All the different exhibits, the face painting, the experiments. It's really a great experience for these young people to get out there and try something that's outside their school. I think this event, that's where I started my spark for engineering. I remember we saw experiments and, and kind of demonstrated how the oil and gas get separated and they get processed. How awesome was that to see it? I have uh, two small children and I thought it'd be a fantastic experience for them to learn about uh, science, technology, engineering, and math. Upon walking in, we're greeted by uh, NASA, and uh, the kids just love that. They, there's all kinds of planets, uh, space station talk, talk about engineering. I've never seen this before, but it's cool, and they're excited, and it's a happening time. It's a happening time. And this is a great way, a great program to supplement the education that the kids are getting in school to make sure that they um, are prepared for education in years to come. I yeah. came with my sister, my dad, and my mom. There's lots of different things to do, and there's a lot of cool experiments. Get away from your social media and your phones and come outside, enjoy a sunny day like this, and actually see energy work in progress. That's why you should bring your kids, your mom, your dad, your sisters, anybody to this Energy Day event and it's free. Don't forget Energy Day, the 11th annual Energy Day, Saturday, October 21st, right here at Sam Houston Park.